This is 825 Elm Court, Marco Island. It's a uh, two bedroom, two bath, uh, 1,712 square feet under air. And it was built in 1973. Now let's go and take a look. Roof looks uh, fairly newer, in very good condition. Landscape looks pretty nice. Yeah, we have uh, tile floors. Uh, this is a little older house, the ceiling's a little bit lower, but the floors are in good shape. You get a mirror wall on the side over here. Uh, to me at left is bedroom number two. It's all carpeted, standard size bedroom. That's a standard size closet. Uh, carpeted floors. Straight ahead would be the um, bathroom number two. Got a single vanity, mirrored walls. There's some, so some damage to the wall here. Uh, I don't know what that's all about. And the tub shower enclosure. For the throne area. Straight ahead, we have sliding glass doors going out to the back pool area. Looks like a nice pool out there. Master bedroom between me at left here. Get carpeted floors. Carpet looks should be changed out a little bit. As jealousy windows. This is a little oversized bedroom. Uh, master bedroom has its own closet area here. You have a single vanity it, uh, for Micah countertop mirrored wall. Uh, it has a standard size shower, regular shower. This needs to be updated. And it's got a couple of closets. It's actually uh, one closet that goes around the corner, it looks like. Yeah, same thing here. So there's a closet there, and this is this closet here. It's all the same. Uh, let's go outside and take a look. Let's go to the other side of the room. Um, going back to the family room, living room area here. Kitchen is over to the on the right side of the building. Uh, kitchen has got the tile countertop. It's broken a bit, needs to be replaced. Sink, original style cabinets. The range looks as though it needs to be replaced also too. Has a dishwasher, stove, microwave, and a refrigerator. This would be a family room area. Dining room right here. This would be the family room, all tile floors again. With sliding doors that go out to the garage. Off to the right here would be um, the laundry room area, the entrance to the garage. Laundry has a uh, wash, has a uh, soaking tub. And the half bath on this side is a single vanity and a half bath. Let's step outside and take a look. See the southern exposure. It's 3 o'clock in the afternoon, lots of sun out here. Nice dock, nice deck out by the dock also too. Uh, the pool area here has a shower outside. Uh, nice shaded area also, so when the sun's out you can stick, stay under the shade and stay, stay cool. Has a pass-through from the kitchen out to this area here too. And there's a side entrance here, goes out down to the, down to the pool area. See some stakes out here, you can see a stake on that end out there. And there's the other end over here too, you'll see another stake. So the property has been recently surveyed. Seawall looks pretty new along here. I'd say it was probably pretty close to brand new along here. I know it's a few spots where it's sunk in here where we need some stone. There's no um, French drain along here, which they should have a French drain. And let's see, there's uh, another section of seawall here. Looks original, but at least it's straight and it looks like it's okay. Uh, the dock area here has got a nice docking set here in the sun. Nice size lift for a boat. It's got direct access, sudden exposure. Any questions, please give me a call. This is Dennis McDonald with Sun Realty. I'm at 239-784-1963. There is a pool heater. The pool pump on this side. The air conditioner on this side also. Too.